going on guys? It's Lucy Goosey and welcome back to some more Crash Landed Survival. So we're back on the Crash Landed Survival map that we played on on Tuesday. And we're going to be continuing this series hopefully for five episodes. But there is some big news in the Xbox the Minecraft community as well as all the other console versions of Minecraft. And that is that TU31, the big giant update, which is supposed to be 1.7 and 1.8, it's crazy, will be coming out tomorrow. Now, I'm not sure if it's exactly true if it's coming out tomorrow, but it could possibly come out tomorrow, and uh, there should be a lot of gameplay of that on my channel tomorrow. I think uh, we'll do one video explaining everything and then another video on like Minecraft Story Mode or something, but uh, yeah, it's pretty awesome. It's coming out tomorrow, and that is just amazing so uh anyways i just cut down our tree so uh yeah we're getting back already into this episode one thing i need to do is uh you know we're gonna have to sacrifice our, our sad looking ship here we're gonna have to sacrifice it because if we want to sleep uh sacrificing our ship is probably the best way to go so we're gonna just yeah yep we're doing it guys we broke our ship and now we're making our bed so that now if it turns nighttime and we can't fight the monsters we have a place to sleep so I think I'll put the bed like right here I don't really know that looks like an okay spot to put it and uh, I also have to show off uh, oh look at this oh I already did I have four and a half stacks of sand I started digging a little bit off camera and uh, we can trade with these guys even more and uh, one thing that I think will be a problem is food oh I can't even reach them hey you come here I need to get stuff can you help me oh my goodness what's going on man I don't even know all right, so maybe we just gotta wait. These guys are like, oh my goodness, move. Give me, give me trades. Hello, hello. Can I please trade with you? <laughs> oh my gosh, look, I can't reach them. Oh my goodness, they better move. Oh my, well, what if I could never trade with them? All right, we got a sapling here though, so that's good. And hopefully we can get two because we do have two pieces of dirt. But I was gonna show off a trade, but I can't even do it because, oh, there's the second sapling that we needed. But I can't even do it because they're not moving. Can you please? Okay, they moved. All right. So one thing I can do is I can buy some dirt here and then I can get some apples. So we're going to buy 10 apples and I don't know if it's going to be smart to do so, but uh, I think it will be because now we have uh, actual bit of food here. So it's not space food. And uh, now we just got to look at some other stuff that might interest us. So uh, 20. All right. So you get some carrots from uh, from feathers. I don't know. Uh, how we're gonna get feathers we got to find a chicken uh, let's see some other stuff here this is what I want so we can get it actually right now we just uh, wait 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 what was it what was I looking at the wheat seeds alright so I think we can get that what how much is a jungle sapling 10 birch or a birch sapling and 10 sand and uh, I don't think that's too hard to get but let's see so we got the birch sapling and now we got the jungle tree so now we should be able to get wheat seeds. All right, so yeah, now we got some good stuff that we can use to get food coming in. So we've got our apples and we also, oh wait, I should probably move this farther away. And we also got, uh, oh, I got rid of my other sapling. All right, well, that kind of stinks. But uh, we also got some wheat seeds to hopefully get started on a farm. But uh, I'm gonna walk over here and go to bed with our newly made bed. Hopefully I don't actually, oh no. What if I actually, take damage after I wake up. All right, I did it. Ooh, that would've been terrible. And our cactus grew last episode too, so that's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, a lot of stuff happening in the, the Minecraft community, and it's pretty cool. Uh, we can put, actually we can set up our wheat farm close to this water so that it actually can get, uh, you know, water coming into it. So I think I have put it right there, and uh, we gotta go make our a hoe so that we can actually uh, do it. Wait. All right, let's open this up. I don't have any sticks except for the enchanted one that I'm not going to waste on uh, making a hoe. But uh, there we go, now we have our hoe and uh, we can go till the land and start planting this wheat that uh, hopefully will do us good. So there we go, plant the wheat and hopefully we can get some wheat farms going here. We are gonna need a lot more dirt though to get it started. So uh, we'll see what happens. We do still have though like way more than enough sand to get us going and also we have an arrow and I forgot to show it off last episode we did get an arrow so that's pretty cool and uh, the arrow can be used uh, because we got our, our bow with infinity so now we can just slay monsters left and right so uh, some other things that we can do this episode I think is just let's check out these trades again can I reach them let me okay I was gonna be like let me talk to you all right so 
I think just the main thing is just we gotta get sand and trade it in for dirt and the dirt can get us some other stuff. My goal for this episode is to start getting some uh, uh, some gold or some iron or something like that. Uh, I wish there was better ways to do it because it's all about cactus. So uh, we just gotta get our cactus farm started today, I really think is what we gotta do. And uh, good thing right there we didn't actually lose it. I didn't do it the right way. But uh, I think what we'll do is we'll just set them up like that and uh, hopefully start getting our cactus farm going. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna think about some other stuff that we can do today and then I'll get back to you guys. Alrighty guys, so I've got some more sand here. I just went digging up some more. So I'm gonna grab all of our sand and I think what we're gonna be doing in this episode is really just getting this tree farm up and started or up and going or whatever. Oh my goodness, villagers, stop it. All right, oh, thank you, okay. I've been having some trouble with villagers today. They don't want to trade with me. It's really annoying. But uh, we're going to trade, I don't know, let's get nine dirt maybe. And let's get like two saplings from that. Because I think we can get other sap. Like there's other ways to get saplings besides just trading the villager with it. But uh, because like obviously once we start cutting down trees, we can get more saplings. But uh, I think what we're going to do is I'm going to take some of this sand. And I'm going to make it into sandstone because I'm fancy. And then I have to go get a crafting bench because I'm going to make this into sandstone slabs. I just want to make it look nice. Like, I don't want just random trees growing all over the place. So I do want to make it look somewhat beautiful. Not really that beautiful, but have a little bit of a personal touch to this tree farm of ours. So I'm going to go out here and uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to move this, obviously, because that's just out in the open. It's not pretty at all. And uh, we're going to actually fill in our previous spots where we dug and uh, dug the sand and actually put in like little uh, sandstone slabs in like this kind of way and then put the dirt in the middle and put the tree down and then I think we can go one two three and then do it again and uh, just keep on doing this and we should fill up this whole area and everything like that after a while and that's kind of like my goal is to uh, get a really good tree farm and just fill up an area like this to uh, just get us situated and also have like good trades with the villagers. So uh, I think, how much can I go? I can go one more, I think. So uh, just go one more here. And then I think like just one, two, three, and then just do it again. And it should be pretty good. I think it's gonna look pretty nice when it's all said and done, but uh, I do have to dig it a little bit more that way so it's even, but uh, let's see. Boom, 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 boom. And then we can do one more. With, oh wait, no, we don't have enough uh, slabs, but you know, we can just do that and do some more later So uh, yeah, I guess I can just wait for these this stuff to grow. I can dig a little bit of sand But I do just want to talk about uh, TU31 a little bit more So if you don't know what TU31 is, it's uh, I'll break some sand actually while I'm doing this TU31 is uh, a new update coming out for Minecraft console. It's pretty awesome It's got all the features from 1.7 that we don't have right now and almost all the features from 1.8. There's a couple left out because uh, capabilities and everything like that. Uh, I don't have the change log on me right now, but I'll try to name a few of the features off the top of my head. So there is a new enchanting... Oh my goodness, my voice. Oh no. All right, so uh, I'm back. <laughs> Just a little five second break there. But uh, I, uh, blah, 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 blah. some of the features include a new enchantment system, which is pretty awesome. You actually need lapis now to enchant uh, with the new update coming out. And uh, you can actually see what you're going to get enchanted, a little bit of what you're going to get. And it also costs less levels. So a level 30 enchant will only actually cost you three levels, but it also will cost you three lapis. So lapis becomes really important, but uh, I say once you have about three stacks of lapis, you really shouldn't need lapis that often ever again. So it's not like it's a really big thing, but in the new update, that's one of the bigger things that has changed. There's also going to be new mobs, which include rabbits, uh, guardians, and uh, let's see, Endermites, and I think there's one other. There's the Chicken Jockey, which is pretty cool. It's like a, a chicken, and then there's a zombie on it, and it's actually really awesome, and that's actually coming out in the new update. But uh, Guardians is a really big thing. I know I said it already, but if you don't know what a Guardian is, uh, there's actually going to be uh, Water Temples, and uh, that brings me into another thing that I'll discuss it later, but there's going to be Water Temples, and uh, it's uh, going to be a new thing, kind of like... Uh, a new boss fight really because there's gonna be some elder guardians and you actually have to find three elder guardians inside of the um, of the water temple and you can get sponges and gold and it's actually a really cool thing it kind of reminds me of the legend of zelda like going through a temple so it's pretty cool and that's another feature coming out as well as new biomes new biomes is gonna be a really big thing there's gonna be like i think it was like 20 new biomes added most of them are just uh different ways that you can see the biome so like 
like a roof forest might have like six different uh, actual specific biomes but uh yeah there's gonna be the roofs forest the mesa biome ice spikes biome um what are some other ones there's the um well i can't think of them off the top of my head right now it's savannah and uh just some ones like that there's the giant ocean which contains the water temples and uh, i'm not really sure of any of the other ones but uh, you can look up the change log by yourself uh, there's a lot of cool features coming out and I'm super excited for it and you guys should be too because after this series we'll be starting a new survival series on the brand new update and it should be pretty awesome. So that is going to do it for this episode. We got a good tree farm started and we also have our cactus going and some wheat going. So hopefully you guys did all enjoy this episode. I'm going to take a nap as we're taking out the episode. We got a lot of sand on us so hopefully we can use that to further ourselves in this survival. Hopefully you guys did all enjoy. I'm out for now. Peace.